the angle of elevation of the top of an unfinished tower at a point of distance 80 meter from its base is 30 degrees. So this is the unfinished tower. This is the unfinished tower. So this is uh, 80 meters. This is 80 meters. Let me say this is 80 meters. Okay. So the angle of elevation is 30 degrees. Angle of elevation is 30 degrees. Okay. How much height must be must uh, be must the tower to be raised so that its angle of elevation at the same point may be 60 degrees? So this is the unfinished tower. Unfinished effort. Unfinished tower. So just I want to raise this. Okay. Now this elevation is this will become 60 degrees. Elevation is 60 degrees. Okay. This is 30 degrees. This is 60 degrees. So, how much? The question is uh, how much height must the tower to be raised? This is 6. So, if it is 30 degrees, so it's uh, this is given, 80 meters is given. Here we have if the height is raised to x. At an elevation of 60 degrees. You want to raise from the question, simple question. So again, there are two triangles. Let I put this is O, this is A, this is B, this is C. Okay. First, I take this triangle that is O, B, C. That is B, O, C. First triangle. So this is the first triangle. This is O, this is 80 meters, this is B, this is C, okay. This is, th this is 30 degrees. Here tan 30 is equal to, tan 30, that is equal to 1 by root 3. So this is acute angle is 30, opposite acute angle is perpendicular. This is perpendicular, this is base, okay. This is perpendicular base. So tan theta is equal to tan theta is equal to tan theta is equal to perpendicular by base. Here this is 1 by root 3. That is equal to perpendicular by base. Base is 80 meters. 80. So 80 by root 3 is equal to A C B. This distance. So this is a C B. 80 by root 3. So what is 80 by root 3? Okay, we calculate 80 by root 3. 80 by root 3 is equal to 46.19. This is 46.19. That is meters. That is equal to a CB. CB is 46.19. 46.19. Next, I will take another, another triangle. This triangle, that is a O C. This is this triangle. This is A. This is A C O. Angle uh, C. That is C. That is angle A O C. So this is this is B. So B C is equal to forty six point one nine. This is X. Therefore, AC is equal to AC is equal to AB that is CB CB AB not CB CB plus uh, CB plus CB plus X. So CB AC is equal to forty six point one nine plus X. Okay. Here this angle is acute angle is sixty degrees. This is sixty degrees. So this is perpendicular. Here this is perpendicular. This is base again tan theta tan theta is equal to here tan theta is equal to tan the 60 tan is equal to root 3 tan 60 is equal to root 3 and then uh, tan theta is equal to perpendicular by base so that is root 3 is equal to perpendicular perpendicular is uh, 46.19 plus x divided by base 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 is given that is 80 meters 
So this is same. This is same. Okay. 80 meters divided by 80. Okay. Therefore, x is equal to so root 3 is simplified. Uh, root 3 into 80 minus 46.19 that is equal to x. Okay. Root 3 into 80 minus 46.19. So one is root 3 into 80 minus 46.19 that is equal to 92.37. So x is equal to 92.37 so this is this is 92.37 meters so this is 92.37 meters that is the that must be the height to be raised so the total height of the tower is total height of the tower is 93.37 92.37 plus uh, what is 46 points so the total height total height of the tower height of the of the tower now tower is equal to 92.37 plus this bit that is bcb cb is equal to 46.19 so what is the thing 92.37 plus 46.19 that is equal to 138.56 138.56 meters okay so that is the total height the question is simple question question is very simple what they are asked is if the, the the height must be raised to miles to be raised so that the angle of elevation is at the same point maybe at 60 degrees if the equal 60 degrees raise for now in the external value on the question so external value 92.37 meters so in addition, we are calculating what is the actual height. Actual height is 138.56 meters. 